morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is Ashni Shamamadan on your favorite channel. So what's up in the kitchen today? Today we are going to make rasam. This rasam, I had an instant idea. So I was able to make a dal rasam, but I was feeling lazy. Then I said, why not try this? So this is a new technique. You can just follow this and believe me, this rasam is truly, truly gathering. This is no dal cooking uh, rasam. But you have dal, but no cooking. So very simple and easy. So let's quickly move to the process. Just soak the tamarind in uh, water. And if it is in urgent, you can just microwave it. And it will be your work done quickly. Now we will be needing garlic. Few pots. Little bit of ginger as it is. Rasam nice. If you are having cold, you can use ginger also. Then you have cumin seeds. One spoon and one big spoon of pepper powder. So everything goes into the mixie. And we shall grind it. Garlic, ginger and you have cumin seeds you have pepper everything goes into mixie and we shall grind it so i have this paste then we have tomatoes one uh, big tomato or small as these are very small tomatoes i'm just going to crush it with hand this is the traditional way of using tomatoes in rasam so they generally don't cut it they just squeeze it and just crush it with hands it is done. Now we are going to just take the pulp of the tamarind and just throw away the excess thing. Just throw it this. Now we have taken the pulp and just throw away this. Discard this. We are going to add little oil. One ladle of oil. You know, little oil. Half a ladle will do. And with this we will be adding mustard seeds. Quarter spoon. When they are hearing the crackling sound, we shall add curry leaves, one big onion cut long and two green peas. This is the instant rasam, very easy, no dal. Now to this rasam, I have taken the pulp of the tamarind. To this we will be adding this masala. Everything goes into this very quickly. Tomatoes, very very easy. Salt to taste. Then you have red chili powder little bit then you have turmeric powder quarter spoon and you have pepper already inside so we shall add little water into this and we shall mix it so i'll be adding three glasses of water into this quickly stir and we shall add into our rasam so when the onions are light pink in color we we'll just fill this mix it well and we shall add this mixture into mix it well and we shall add it to so simple so easy just see the beautiful color so healthy believe me the kitchen is full aromatic it is so yummy you can just eat in this way but we, today we are not going to make using dal. Very simple technique, very easy. You need not have the pressure of boiling the dal, steaming it, smashing it. Very simple and yet very yummy. I have tried it and this was an instant thing. I just used my idea and believe me, it is very, very yummy. Just add water to the gram flour. You can use the roasted gram flour, basin, roast it or even if, without roasting also you can use it. Chana dal you can use. So in this way you can just add, you can add the dal into this. So this rasam will be dal rasam but not using dal. So very simple and easy. Use it and believe me it is truly yummy. Stir it well. Just see the beautiful color and this is very healthy because ginger, garlic, then you have onion, tomatoes, tamarind pepper into this cumin seeds very very healthy you can just have it as a soup also in winter or rainy season this is very very good for your cold and cough and whenever you add gram flour to this many people in north india they have sira right so having again basin or the gram flour 
this way you can enjoy the rasam it is very very yummy just try it out and we just plate it now so now we shall enjoy this rasam this is without using dal instant dal rasam so this will be really a truly a different yummy recipe and if you are a non vegetarian if you are a non vegetarian just use the chicken cutlet i have recently made and today i was making chicken cutlet and rasam so you can just follow my recipe of chicken cutlet too so if you're loving the process please do like share and subscribe my channel my name is rajni sharma madan and many such interesting videos on the way have a pleasant day see you tomorrow it's very simple and you don't feel like boiling the dal or waiting for it smashing it you can just use this uh, so if you're loving it please do try to make it at home and please do comment in the comment box and how was it did you like it because your comments are the most important thing so thank you for subscribing and watching my video and many such interesting videos on the way i not only upload related to food but many interesting things like gardening gardening recipes then your pets restaurants so many things tips so coming up we have so many things so keep watching have a pleasant day